<laughs> What's up, Dino Furnace? Welcome back to another Jade Rex video. We are checking out Plantera 2 Golden Unicorn. I played the first one a while ago and I like 100% and I collected everything, all the achievements. And now this one came out and I've been waiting for it to go on sale and it just hasn't dropped enough. So I got it in the winter sale for a Christmas present and that's really cool. So we're going to check this out and I don't know, just have fun with it, I guess. So let's go into our farm. dreaming ah. that oh <laughs> it's still cute Slowly watch it grow. Hey! Oh, I forgot we're supposed to catch a fish or whatever. So, basically the concept of this game is you get a little farm. And you start small, and then you slowly collect more plants, more trees, and then you get animals, and it gets a little crazy and chaotic. So it's just like a little simple, entertaining idol game. And, you know, if you guys do that kind of thing, it's pretty cool. We can get a bush now, so bush. for another event. Get our butterfly soup. Out of here, bird. So there's a lot of things that you have to pay attention to with getting um think certain things away from your crops because you don't want them to disappear. See, we get a new. We can't get a new guy yet. Get out of here. Oh, we got to level three. Now we have a new one. That's good. I was like, no, I'm gonna have to buy one, but I think we can buy a tree. We get to twenty-five. So, another tree. Bunnies, birds, there's fish. Man, there's a lot going on. Eventually it gets to the point where you have things that like automatically take care of it. So that's what we're doing here. Just slowly. It's like a little meowing. We can get a K at when I have 50 coins. Oh yeah, you gotta like move around. That was a pretty lucky um, 
Pitch catch. Got that one, so. Let's get cat. Almost lost a veggie. Yeah, we're five. We can now plant carrots. Oh, click and drag. Sunflower. Oh, I thought we got an achievement. No. see a place for us to place it. Ah, oh, bird turk our thing. Six, we get a new one. Okay. Ah, I got an achievement. Catch ten fish. to Looks like a mouse. Is that supposed to be a wolf? I don't think a cat would run away from a mouse. See, I mean, pretty, pretty cute game. You just kind of level up and build your farm, and then eventually you have all the bestest stuff. Oh, we get them upgrades. 
Okay. I bought a lot. I didn't... I didn't know what I was doing. I was just clicking. Cat makes ball. Ball gets five coins. Got to seven, and we got another achievement. Mini bird, feather of coins. If you build a house, my dudes are falling by. Also, an unintentional fist catch. Yeah. Oh, I fed a bunny. Yeah. So, this is the game. It's. Oops. Cute and pretty simple, pretty easy, kind of like an upgrading process here. Eventually, you get like the whole screen you get to plant in, and you get all the coins. Yeah, he's definitely supposed to be a wolf. I believe our garden is looking pretty good. Like, like I told y'all, it's pretty fun playing this game. Nice, simple, and kind of relaxing. It didn't take too long to beat the first one, so I'm just gonna kind of play this every day and relax. It's like a little farming game without me having to do literally anything except watch somebody else do it. <laughs> Cause I don't I don't like these I don't like farming games. And yet, you know, palico pines, you know. <laughs> oh paleo pines, not palico. Whatever. <laughs> it's almost the same, but not at all. Get out of here. Make a magpie drop something. I did it. We're kicking butt with these achievements, y'all. Yeah, I would definitely say check it out if you kind of like idle games that aren't like super idle. Once you start building it up, you get your upgrades and when you go towards the end of farm achievements, I'm assuming there's probably achievements where I have to farm. Um, it kind of works like this, so. It's pretty nice. Pretty nice. But other than that, uh, thanks for watching another random game from my Steam library, and uh, you'll find out when I complete it. What's up, Dino Friendos? All right, so this is the ending of our Planterra 2 Golden Unicorn video. I went and I finished it completely just so I could show you what craziness this looks like. So I came back, I have 7 million coins and 238 golden acorns. Nice, right? We got to 103. So one of the achievements is you have to get to level 100. You only get one level if you are off for an extended period of time, only one. So if you want to get your levels quickly, you need to leave your game open. Just, just an FYI for you guys. But this is my farm. I'm just going to slowly scroll. This is my farm. It is 
chaotic. It is massive. And there's still more plots you can get. Crazy, right? So, yeah. There's lots and lots and lots of stuff. Tons of trees and bushes. And I have bees that come out and attack enemies to get rid of them. And then I have birds that make bird feathers and cows and unicorns and horses. And oh my goodness, there's so many things here. It's, it's insane. Oh, and then there's this guy who comes in. And if you click him, you get a bunch of coins. That's super neat. But basically what you use your acorns for is you level up your tree, which is really cool. And you can get coins within this one. This is your birds for birdhouses to make more money rather than just having these birds. And then you have the bees. And then this gets you like a golden acorn. It just gives you, I don't know, points? I really don't understand the point of this one, but... These are all the cool things you get as you get through it. So you get the birds, you get fences, which helps deter creatures. So you get less of the little enemies. And then this is your scarecrow, which helps get rid of the birds coming down. The frogs will catch your butterflies. The clock gives you more time for your offline investment, which is always really nice. So definitely do that. We have the wolf or a doggy who scares all the other animals too. This makes jam out of all the berries, which is really neat. The dolphin hit, hits the fish. And makes them pop up on top of here. And then the guys collect them. This is a windmill. Which just helps us make more money. And then this is a coin multiplier bonus. So every time you increase this. The amount of your coins you get. Gets more and more and more. So it's pretty neat. Uh, yeah. There's tons. There's two pages of five of everything. So make sure you definitely push that over button so you can see all the stuff you're supposed to collect one of the achievements inside this game is to actually get one of every item so one of every bush one of every crop one of every tree one of every animal one of every hat so make sure you do that it's pretty simple really easy to get all the achievements in this game overall let's go to my library here and look at the playtime we are at 17.3 hours so it doesn't take long at all to actually earn the achievements the one problem I had with this game is if I had too much happening at once, like if I was trying to lay down my decorations or collect a lot of fruit at once, the game would actually freeze and then crash. Which it's doing right now. Yeah, look at that. <laughs> I, I, I don't know why it does that, but that's what it does. So we'll open it back up. Make it all nice and pretty again. Oh, and there's aliens. I don't know why I have aliens, but there's aliens too. So yeah, this is the thing. Maybe it's because I turned off the cinematic. I don't know, but we'll see. So it's it's a lot of fun. It's really simple, like a very, very simple idle game. You literally do nothing but plant crops, farm coins, get all the items, and do the possible upgrades. That's it. It's, you know, it's nice. It's cute. Um, my friend actually thought it was Maple Story last night, so <laughs> I guess that's going for it. I don't know. But yeah, so I just wanted to show you that I did fully complete this game. We are donezo. It's crashing again. Uh, yeah. My, um, I don't like this game, apparently. Like, the, my computer is just like, no, I'm done. I'm done playing this game. I'm done. So... Yeah, let's, I'll just show you the Steam page, I guess, because it doesn't want to do what I want it to do. So let's just, uh, Steam. Yeah, all right. So here we are, fully completed, 100%, which is really great and easy. Again, 17.3 hours, doesn't take long. I do recommend this game if you're kind of into those simple idle games where you don't have much to do and you just kind of want to play a farm without playing a farm because you ain't got to do shit except plant it. <laughs> so, yeah, really cute game. And again, uh, yeah, that's another game completed. We did it, yeah, yes. So let's, we could check here real quick. I'll go ahead and add it to all of our categories. I have not reviewed it yet, though. So I have to review it, and then I'll go in that category. But we can go here, and you can see that we now have 206 games completed. We did it. I'm so excited. Oh, and I completed Card Hog again. They keep adding achievements, which was the final boss, and that took forever to do, but I took my time and I got it. So, yeah, there we go. Woo!
achievements. I'm doing it. 206 games out of 1900. <laughs> All right, my lovely dino friendos. Thank you so much for joining me here today on this Plantera 2 Golden Acorn video. Yeah, and uh, I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.